Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, what are the exceptions to the Fourth Amendment's warrant requirement? I can answer this question with a little help from Jules Winfield. For those of you who don't know Jules, he was Samuel L. Jackson's character in Quentin Tarantino's quintessential film, Pulp Fiction. I'm going to specifically refer to the scene where Pumpkin, Tim Roth, and Honey Bunny, Amanda Plummer, begin their armed robbery in the Hawthorne Grill, a.k.a. Holly's. As Vincent Vega, John Travolta, is in the restroom, Pumpkin approaches Jules, points her gun at him, and demands his wallet. Now, anyone who's seen Pulp Fiction knows that Jules' wallet is the one that literally says, bad mother effer. Well, here in the real world, with a dash of ingenuity and a dribble of spin, Epic MF is an acronym for the six major exceptions to the Fourth Amendment's warrant requirement. Epic Mother Effer, or Epic MF, breaks down to E for exigent circumstances, P for plain view, I for incident to arrest, C for consent, M for motor vehicles, and F for found property. Noting that I'll be detailing each of these in their own individual videos, following are nutshell definitions. Exigent circumstances allows for a warrantless entry where people are in immediate danger, evidence faces imminent destruction, or a suspect's escape is impending. Plain view covers situations where police are lawfully in a place and at that time they happen to see something that's obviously, patently, either illegal or incriminating. Incident to arrest allows police to conduct a warrantless search of an arrestee's person as well as the area within that person's immediate control, which is also known as the wingspan. So long as it's done knowingly, intelligently, and voluntarily, anyone is free to waive their Fourth Amendment protections and to consent to a warrantless search. If police have probable cause to believe that evidence or contraband is in a motor vehicle, then they can search that car without a warrant. And finally, found property refers to any items over which someone makes it evident that a surrender of their privacy interest has occurred. For instance, say you set your garbage out on the street for collection. In that case, the boys in blue can collect it and sift through it for incriminating evidence without a warrant. There are other recognized warrant requirement exceptions such as borders, FISA, officer safety, Terry stops, prisons, and schools, but you can't squeeze those into epic MF. That said, I want to thank you for your question and I appreciate your having asked it. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll be putting out more soon.